Hello everyone, this is me, Ryan. Um, some people know me as John Doe. I'm here in Tokyo, as always, on this uh, Ghost Slayers report. Now, I was watching a video recently uploaded by uh, Nearer Brew Magic uh, 2012, I believe, in which it was a series of photos and some interesting little tidbits of information. But uh, overlaid on all the pictures and things was this initial response uh, released by Barack Obama in the United States. Basically, he was talking about how sad he was for Japan and how America is going to help. And in some ways, America did help. I remember a lot of things went down during that time. And um, yeah, America did a lot of good things. I have to admit that. Right? But then he gets to the point of um, nuclear power in, in America. Now, his tone changes rather quickly. It goes from, oh, what a disaster. Oh, the Japanese people have to rethink their energy policy. To, um, in America, we're prepared. In America, we're taking um, all the greatest of precautions with our own safety of our own energy uh, infrastructure. And um, there's nothing to worry about. He said, um, the experts in D.C. there said that there will be no danger from people in Hawaii, California, Washington State. None of those people are going to be affected by it. You don't need to take extra precautions. Don't, you know, think about evacuating or moving or, or uh, changing your diet or anything or preparing in any way, shape, or form. You won't be affected at all. Really? Okay, well, as you come to find out, um, Mr. Obama there wasn't exactly telling the truth or he honestly didn't know. I know politicians are crooked as a high to hold them. But I do want to give people the benefit of the doubt because you are talking about nuclear power. Okay, so either he lied or he just didn't know or they weren't really prepared as they said they were. So a few months go down the line, you know, and um, lo and behold, radiation levels spike in Hawaii a bit. I think a lot of people has been keeping up with it, noticed that. Uh, there were some strange hot spots, came out in California. And we all know in Washington, the nuclear plume from Fukushima took its path right past Washington State. And, of course, there is the all the uh, wash-up from the tsunami that's come on the shore to those, those areas. And those, those, some of those material have been radioactive. So, Mr. Obama, you're wrong about it. And now we see in America where, the, where there's courts on many different levels, I've reported on some of this in the past, have been blocking nuclear power industry. I've been asking for better standards. Uh, currently, I believe the, the ban on renewing any nuclear power plant or the ban on um, approving uh, contracts to build new ones is still in play at this point, I believe. And, and that was all about um, temporary storage facilities at nuclear power plants. Uh, the industry was uh, mandated to find permanent locations for those while they were... Um, looking for, while they were having the temporary ones with very loose standards and not really any um, system or uh, qualifications to store it or how to store it, as long as you keep it there till you find a better place, right? And that's sad. And that, that leads us into uh, the biggest thing going on in America right now as far as nuclear power. This um, situation with this storage facility in the States. You haven't heard about this, go look it up. Apparently, apparently it's leaking really bad. Now officials have uh, been saying that um, it's no danger, don't worry. But then they come around and say it might be a bigger problem than we know about. I'll leave some links in the below. You can check that out, okay? Be sure to check links because I do put them in there sometimes, so don't forget to, you know, yeah, okay? Alright, so yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and finish this up, guys. Just want to cover that thing on Near Brew Magic's upload and Barack Obama's speech, how Obama dropped the ball. In the current Storage facility in America right now, it's puking out radiation. They don't know what to do. Leave comments and comment box below. As always, guys, till next time, it's me, Ryan, here in Tokyo, Japan. Checking out.